welcome to sakalvidya.com. In the last episode section we have seen introduction part and the compliments. Now we have come out with multiplication of single digit. That is 9 into 8. Already we know what is 9 into 8. But how to solve this by a simple method? In the previous session, you all learned the complements. Once again, I'll revise. 9 complements. 1 plus 8. 2 plus 7. 3 plus 6. 4 plus 5. Again, 5 plus 4. 6 plus 3. 7 plus 2. 8 plus 1. That is 9. So, complement of 9 is 1. And complement of 8, it is 2. That is a complement of 10, 1 plus 9, 2 plus 8, 3 plus 7, 4 plus 6, 5 plus 5. The complement of 9 for the big friend 10, it is 1. For 8, it is 2. So, 9 plus 1 or 10 minus 9 it is 1 or 10 minus 8 2. Here we have taken the base 10. Base 10 10 minus 9 that is 1. Again 10 minus 8 2. Now what we will do is we will multiply these units place 1 into 2 that is 2 and from 9 we will subtract 9 minus 2 7 or 8 minus 1 it is 7. So, therefore, 9 into 8 is 72. Let us see one more example. 8 into 6. Complement of 8 that is 2. Complement of 6 for the big friend it is 4. Same way multiply 2 into 4. 2 into 4 that is 8. From 8 subtract 4. 8 minus 4 that is 4 or 6 minus 2 it is 4. So, 8 into 6 is 48. So, by, by using the base 10 we can solve any table. Here we no need to in the speed max we no need to learn all the tables. Just if you know 5 tables that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 the remaining tables we can work out easily. Let us see some more examples. Seven into three. The complement of seven, that is three. Complement of complement of eight, that is seven into eight. Two, three twos are six. Seven minus two, five. Eight minus three is also five. Cross subtract, and units are multiplied. Three twos are six. Seven minus two is five, or eight minus three is five. So seven is a fifty-six. 6 into 4, we will see. 6 complement is 4 and complement of 4 is 6. 6 4s are 24. Here we are getting the 2 digit numbers. So, we will be writing only the units place and 2 will be carried. From 6 minus 6 it is 0. 0 plus 2 it is 2 or 4 minus 4 it is 0, 0 plus 2 again 2. So, 6 4s are 24. We will work out some more example. 9 into 7. Complement of 9, it is 1. Complement of 7, that is 3. 1 3 is a 3. 9 minus 3, that is 6. 7 minus 1, 6. So, the answer is 63. 9 into 7 is 63. So, you may get a doubt why I have to learn these steps. When we go for the higher numbers, in the next sections you will be learning of multiplication of two digits number all that. In that it will be useful. This is the basic things where you can use this multiplications. 
Let's work out with some more examples. Six into nine. The complement of six. It is four. Complement of nine. That is one. Four into one. And six minus one. That is six minus one is five, and four ones are four. So it is fifty-four. Seven into six. The complement of seven. It is three. Complement of six. That is four. Here, three fours are three into four. We are getting two-digit number twelve. Seven minus four. That is three. Or six minus three is also three. Just we'll be adding this extra value here, which should be only one digit. So two, three plus one, four. So seven into six is forty-two. Like this, we can solve so many problems. This is by using the base ten. We have taken the base as ten. All the values which are nearer to the ten, say nine into nine, nine nine, nine nine zero. We are solving from nine. Ten minus nine is one. Again, ten minus nine is one. One one zero one. Nine minus one it is eight. Nine minus one like this or in this way. Nine minus one it is eight. Say eight into eight. Two complement of eight is two. Again, complement of eight is two. Two twos are four. Eight minus two six, or eight minus two is six. So eight eights are sixty-four. Seven into seven. Complement of seven is three. Again, for the complement of seven, it is three. Three threes are nine. Seven minus three, that is four. You have seven minus three is four. So seven seven is forty-nine. I'll say one more example. Six. It is four. For six again four. Again four four is sixteen. We are getting two-digit number. Six minus four. It is two. So the extra the ten-digit number will be added to this one. So two plus one it is three. So the six six is thirty six. Let's see some more example like seven into five. The complement of seven it is three, and complement of five it is five. Multiply the units. Five three is fifteen. And seven minus five, it is two, or five minus three, it is two. So we have only the two-digit number, single-digit number. The answer should be in the two-digit. But we have here three digits. So we'll add this one to the here. So two plus one, it makes three. So seven into five, it is thirty-five. Let's see one more example. Seven into four. Seven complement is three, and four complement is six. Three into six it is eighteen. Seven minus six it is one, or four minus three it is one. Again, the same process will be adding. That is balancing of numbers. One plus one it is two, and eight. That is seven into four is twenty-eight. I hope the viewers have understood this multiplication of single-digit number. In the next section, we'll be coming out with the multiplication of two digits of any two-digit numbers by using the some base. Here, the we are use the base ten system. In the next, we'll be using the base hundred, base thousand like that. the process will be same let's we'll see some examples we'll work out in the next section with 
multiplication of single double digit numbers. Here we have learned the single digit number that is base 10. I hope you understood the multiplication of single digits what we have discussed the base 10 system in this today's session. We will be coming out with the different concept that is multiplication of double digits and in the future you will be having the divisions all that. Thank you.